I am back, ladies and gentlemen. Now, did you get the opportunity to watch the very first video of the day? If not, smash that bell. You will get a notification from YouTube. Now, I have social media accounts, and don't worry, I will discuss it after this part of the video is over. Now, once again, sit back, relax, put your feet up, grab some meat, or grab some drink. Or maybe, just maybe, you want to chill like a villain and hear my thoughts, my opinions on this subject. And of course, the link will be down below, or the article will be down below. Now, this one, there will be a link because of the article plus the video down below. Alrighty then, let's get into this conversation. Now, when do you think Cody Rose will make his return to the company? You think it will be at the Royal make a shocking appearance, win the whole thing, and challenge the champion? Or do you think that he has other plans for him? What are your thoughts on his return? How would you book Cody Rhodes' return to the company? How would you book him? Will you book him on Raw? Will you book him on SmackDown? Or will you make him make an epic return at the Royal Rumble? How would you do it? How? How? Of course, he's not going to return by the time this year is over. There's no way. It's not going to happen. There's no point to it. Okay? I mean, I could be totally wrong. Okay, listen to this. Corey Rhodes worked two months for W after returning at WrestleMania 38 before being sidelined with a tore muscle. So that sucks. He had a great feud with Seth Frick Rollins. Uh, hopefully, he will never come back. He will not continue that feud with Seth Frick Rollins. Probably he will because of what happened when when Seth Rollins, Seth Frick Rollins and Cody Rhodes they hugged it out, and and then um, you could see that you you could tell that Seth Frick, flipping Rollins was going to do some stupid, take him out. That was not necessary to do that. They should just have that great moment. And that was it. So most likely they will continue their feud. Whenever Cordy Rose is back. Or maybe they'll be decided to. Not do that. I don't know if that was. George's idea or Vince's. I forgot who was in charge. In that time frame. Please let me know. I hopefully it ends because. I'm tired of it already. And let Cody Rhodes. Do other things like if he can't be able to compete at the Royal Rumble at the beginning of 2023, then there's another no there's other op options he could be part of the Money in the Bank. He was gonna be in it um, this summer, but he was injured, and they they made a nice video package for him. So remember that one, and they they post that happened in. Home of the Raiders, but they can't sell enough tickets. So he was still in Las Vegas, but it was at MGM, and people were ripping the W. So now, if that was WrestleMania, that would be a different ball game. If that was SummerSlam, that would be a different ball game. If that was a uh, Rumble, that would be a different ball game. That means people will go out of their way to spend money at this big event, but it's money a bank. So that was a stupid decision. I'm sorry. Stupid decision. They should just not have it in a big stadium. I know McMahon, that's his thing. Big stadium, you know. I don't know if Triple H will follow McMahon's footsteps in that direction. Maybe, maybe not. Who knows. Okay, all the information down below. Now listen to this. While speaking to TMZ Sports, the video down below if you guys want to watch it. Rhodes said doctors still won't give him a timetable for when he could return in in-ring action. The doctor will not give him any return when he will return to in-ring action. I think he, I think the doctor knows, but he doesn't want to tell Cody Rhodes. Or maybe he does. Maybe Cody Rhodes does know, 
when he's going to return, they just want to spill it on the internet. They want to keep it hush hush. So all the information down below, you can read it and you can watch the video if you guys are curious. Now, I feel sorry for these wrestlers and these any entertainers because the teams TMZ Sports are very very nosy, but I guess that's their job, you know. I wonder if any of these wrestlers or any celebrities ever smack, you know, like talk back to TMZ, you know, like be rude to them off camera before they ever roll on them, or do they ask permission before they hit the cameras? I was just wondering how does that work. I'd be very nervous. I was if I was the cameraman. Hey, Curry Rose, I want to ask you a couple questions about your return, possible return. Hey, look, Michael Jordan, I want to ask you a couple questions, that kind of thing. I'd be very nervous. Would you be nervous? I'd be terribly nervous. I'm always nervous. I'm just a nervous guy. So, don't judge me. That's how I feel. Anyway, let me know what you think about this. And once again, how would you book the return of Cody Rhodes? Like, we win the Rumble. If not, maybe you could be part of the Olympic Chamber, win that, and go on to face the champion. You know, I don't know how WWE is going to plan on him of his return. And what will be his first feud when he returns? Are they going to continue with the feud with Seth Rick Rollins or someone else? Hopefully somebody else. I hopefully it's not Roman because Roman probably will beat the crap out of him. No offense. And I don't know. We'll see what's going to happen, you know. We'll see. Anything is up there. It's a way too early to discuss about the rest of media plans, or isn't it? Okay, now I want to switch gears. You guys can follow me on Instagram, Twitch, Twitter, TikTok. All my social media accounts will be down below. If you really want to be part of the Robert Show, that's fine and dandy. But please don't make fun of me. Come on, discuss about random crap. We could discuss about a lot of good stuff. But don't make fun of me. Once again, have a good one. And enjoy the rest of your Sunday. And once again, today's NFL game day. Good luck with your team. Peace out. See you guys tomorrow.